Okay, here's a quick uh, preview of quiz six. So first we've got this grid and um, they ask you to find a point five three. So remember that it's kind of like algebra. The first number is horizontal, the second number is vertical, but we start at uh, the left corner of the screen. Okay, so five, is five to the right from uh, this blue point by A. So one, two, three, four, five, and then three down, one, two, three. Okay, look where that uh, takes us there. Question two, now the point three, five. Okay, well, three, five, we gotta go one, two, three, and then one, two, three, four, five to get to that point. Okay, the point D, again, trying to find where things are located. Uh, what function should be used to draw a box? Well, a box is like a, a rectangle or a, um, a square, right? And rectangles and squares are both polygons. Okay. Uh, consider this command, which represents the radius. So do you remember which of these was the radius? We have uh, some parameters for the center. We have some. We have a parameter for the radius, a parameter for the um, thickness of the line and uh, the color. Um, so, uh, if you don't remember, you can always go back and look at the lesson. And then again, then, so then you have to find which of these is a line color. Um, now. This is a question about loops. We use for loops instead of while loops when. Well, one of the big things about for loops is we have to uh, specify how many times the, the loop is going to run. So if we, if we know how many times we want the loop to run, then that's a, a for loop. That's probably one of the answers there. Um, maybe there's a definite starting and ending point. Okay, uh, now considering the following code, which is the, which is the correct drawing? So we have draw polygon. Okay, uh, some kind of uh, rectangle or square it looks like here. That's the, the coordinates of the square. The line thickness is three. Then you've got um, black and gray. So you gotta figure out are they saying that uh, the line is black and the inside is gray? It looks like all the lines are black. So we can assume that that, that one right there is the line color. So then the, the last parameter must be the uh, shading. Okay, so this, uh, this square has a black line and a gray shading. And then this circle, has a black line, but it has white shading inside. Okay, so which one of these is the correct answer? We can uh, think about that. Number nine, uh, what is wrong with uh, this? Okay, um, well, we have a line from 300 to 400, uh, maybe a thickness, maybe a color. Uh, let's see, there's not a second point. There should be a second color. Okay, oh, that's a good point. There's not a second point. So this is, there are two numbers, but that just like with X and Y coordinates, that just gives you one point. So it's hard to draw a line if you only have one point. And then uh, what is returned by the code range uh, from 20 to 100 going by 30s? Okay, so we're going from 20 to 100 going by 30s. So 20, 50, 80, and then we should be done there. Okay, so there are some pretty big hints on the quiz. I uh, hope that helped and uh, good luck.